All right, remember when I used to do Mindstorms unboxings <laughs> instead of just trains all the time? Well, I got a couple more today. I didn't even need this one, but it was it was a good deal. So <laughs> let's open these up and see what we got. All right, so this one, oh, I forgot to look at the prices for what I paid these, but these have actually been sitting in the living room for a bit, um, waiting to be opened. But if there are batteries eating it alive, I'd want to know sooner rather than later. And we have a USB tower, which does not have batteries. And it feels light. There's no batteries in it. The yeah, yuck. Trying to get it to focus. Yeah, it's not that bad. Maybe. I don't know. Um, it'll probably just go <laughs> into the, the bin of shame for stuff I haven't had time to clean the battery acid out of. Um, there's our brick separator. We've got our um, belts look like they're in great condition. They do tend to break down a little bit over time. Um, uh, let's see, where's our motors? We'll check that real quick. They did kind of, they did a little bit of sorting here with the, by color. Yep, there, well there's one motor. Should be two. Ugh, this is like taped in there. Come on guys. Okay. Don't need to do all that. There's our garbage wires that we will repair. Not a problem. Maybe just the one motor. It, it sounds okay. It, it spins. Um, these are notorious for locking up. If you haven't seen my other videos where I pulled a bunch out that are locked up. Yep, yeah, there's the other motor. Oh, come on. Oh, that's always what happens. People either package too much or too little. <laughs> They'll just throw loose pieces in, into a cardboard box with openings in it and send it on its way. And then other people, it's like Fort Knox trying to get in there. Ooh, very dusty. Um, all right, cool. Well, it, oh my God, it's filling pieces everywhere. Uh, do we get anything cool in here? Not really. There's the first Lego League thing that we've, uh, I've kind of went over all this kind of stuff before in other videos. A parent's guide to Lego's Mindstorms. Okay. Um, I am not a parent. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, got some more pieces. Like I said, it was just like, I guess it, I was watching it on Mercari and the seller sent me an offer and apparently I couldn't refuse it. <laughs> I was like, yep, send it on over. All right, this is one. This is a set I've never owned. I have several of the um, Micro Scouts. Uh, in that color, you know, so they would have come from the set, but never owned the set. Um, I, I have no idea what's in here. Um, kind of hoping it has the physical instructions. Um, I'm not sure if it if it came with any if there was any software for the set. Um, you know, the other the Droid Developer Kit. I hope you can hear me over all, all that. Um, uh, the Droid Developer Kit had a CD and kind of all most of the instructions were digital. Um, okay, <laughs> a little blow out there. Ew, more dust. Grody. Alright. 
Ooh, like I, I don't, I don't think I have any sixteen tooth gears in in red, and these uh, bevel gears in red. That's kind of cool. I do like to to use this sometimes in certain things. Some plates, some tires. Nothing too crazy. I always thought these were cool, but I don't know if I've ever really used them for anything besides building a set. Ooh, it's got batteries in it. Um, all right, Walgreens, don't let me down. Not sponsored. Okay, very cool. No problems. These were made in Illinois. They don't have a date, but they're going in the trash because I don't trust them. Um, yeah, so that looks pretty clean inside. So that's great. Um, I imagine it works. I never thought about that. I guess these motors, I think internally they're very at least very similar to the geared nine, nine volt motor. So it would have been possible for that to be seized up, I guess. I don't know. I haven't really seen anybody post about that. Okay, so I got that. Oh, oh boy, we got a bunch of stuff in here. Was, <laughs> and some stuff that don't belong. Sorry, I'm dropping pieces. Um, uh, we got this. <laughs> These sets were kind of cool. I don't know if I... I think my little brother might have had one or two of these sets, the Arctic series that might have been during a dim age of mine or something. Oh, very cool. Got some like real life photos, a picture of a camera for some reason. <laughs> um, well, that's cool. Uh, oh, definitely wasn't expecting that. Um, again, I, th I think this was a Goodwill auction. Um, Send in the attached postcard for a free Lego shop at home catalog. God, I loved getting these catalogs in the mail. That was, it was like, that was my entertainment. <laughs> so we've got some info on the RES 2.0. Bionicle. I don't know how you feel about Bionicle. I was never, I mean, my little brother was into it and, his, and a friend of his, um, I think it was a good thing for the company. Um, I had that guy too, but I actually, that was one of my first things. God, I don't know how long ago that was now. Um, that I pieced together and sold on eBay. Um, and kind of started buying and selling then. I remember those guys. Those were, those were cool too. Um, Robotics Adventure System 2.0. Vision Command. Uh, which is fun. I'm, I do plan to cover that eventually. Um, we got some of the add-on packs. I still need to get an Exploration Mars one. And then that's the set we got today. And that's one uh, I opened not that long ago. I still need to. I'm going to get around to it. <laughs> I'm going to try to do some kind of review, retrospective kind of things. Okay, so we got book one, book two, book three. So, doesn't look like there was any software, um, which is, uh, so I guess this set and the Robotics Discovery set, I guess, I think were the only two that wouldn't have come with a CD-ROM. Um, because, yeah, these are, these are pretty thick compared to some of the others um so that's cool so yeah this this will be fun to go through it's something i've never had before this is the i always like that where they just include random kind of little stuff and um ideas and there it is the atat -AT walker so this is going to be fun. This will be something I haven't been through before. Um, so I'll 
see what I need for pieces. Hopefully it's got all the pieces there and uh, I should be able to piece together. I, I, I can already see I'm, I'm in pretty good shape to get this complete. So sweet. Um, I think that's it. Um, hopefully I've, I've appeased the YouTube algorithm a little bit by getting back to Mindstorms. I don't know. <laughs> Those first two videos did like a thousand views each and everything after that's done like a hundred But everything after that was like trains. I don't really care but I Don't want everybody in the world to watch my videos. I want people who want to watch my videos to be able to find them That's it Because um, there's so many channels that I've found over the years and would have loved to find them earlier, you know, or, um So it, 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 it gets frustrating. <laughs> um, you know, I could change things and do, I could, I could not be true to myself and get more views, but I'm not going to do that. So I appreciate you guys. Any of you who hang out to the end of the video, you are appreciated. See you in the next one.